Okay, good morning, everyone. It's uh, Mr. Lee, Wild and Free. Saturday morning, another DIY project that I'm doing for the Camaro. And I'm out here looking crazy because it is sunny. Waiting on my camera to uh, focus. What the crap? Come on. Is it that bright? It can't be that bright. There we go. That's a little better. But waiting on my camera, focus, here we go. So I'm looking crazy as I stated because look at me. I uh, got a hoodie on and I just showed you my DIY secret. So let's just jump right to it. Okay. I ordered the Hero reflector lenses for the Camaro. And these, I love them but these are a pain in the ass to install i've seen the video that ricardo did for their shop car well i'm gonna tell you this i have the stock exhaust and the bumper brace is right on the other side of that housing and it runs all the way across to the other side it is a pain in the butt to unloosen the two screws that are on the bottom of that diffuser yesterday i went ahead and took off my rear extension and loosened the screws on the driver's side as well just to get enough room basically i pulled down on the rear diffuser i had to use a screwdriver's pry bar to pry everything down take out the screw from the original reflector remove the reflector install this reflector find the hole screw it back in it took me about 40 minutes and I was highly frustrated I mean super frustrated because the install is not it's not easy at all I know uh, if you guys follow my channel and follow online car shows channel he just did a video I want to say a week and a half ago installing these and he will tell you too they are a pain in the butt to install but once you have it installed oh it looks good compared to stock there is a stock which for me I really didn't have a gripe about the stock because it matched my paint job so I liked it but for those that have the white uh, SS the blue SS the bright red SS the yellow SS the silver SS or the, the, the gray SS you guys might want this look and don't get me wrong, I love this look. So that's why I purchased them and I installed them. So, uh, oh, and the reason why I have on my hoodie, I don't know if you can see these things flying around. There's a whole bunch of mosquitoes out here in this garage. There's one. There's two right there by my, uh, by my leg. These blood suckers are out and they are ready to feast. They feasted on me yesterday. They're not gonna feast on me today. That's why I'm wearing a hoodie. That's why I'm wearing the long sleeve pants or the long jogging pants. And I do have the fan blowing on me. Um, so anyway, today I'm going to continue with the other part of the install. So I will be installing the other um, reflector for the passenger side. And I hope that's going to be the easier side to do. Okay. And the other thing that I did yesterday were the tail lights. So this is my stock original tail light. And what I did was I asked around and 
basically shops want to charge big money to do what I did. Now, if you don't think that you're comfortable tinting your own tail lights, then by all means take it to a shop. But I'm comfortable tinting my own tail lights. So that's what I did. I went purchased a can of tape sprint uh spray tint and I put one good coat on it and I let it dry. As you can see I did tape up the area where the reverse light uh will be because I wanted that to kind of match the reflector. The reflector is black and light gray now so is my tail light my tail light is black and light gray and i'll zoom out so you can see them both and i think it looks good i think it looks great so from a distance here we have the stock side here we have the not so stock side but it's still stock and i think that the not so stock side looks a heck of a lot better than the stock side now so today i'm going to go ahead take out my other tail light so I can get it sprayed and then I'll install it once everything is finished and then I'm gonna remove the factory reflector and install the phase tech hero reflector on my passenger side so stay tuned once I have everything finished I will give you a uh, after video that way you can see everything on the car and it will all match right now it's kind of looking crazy but it all match it looks crazy but at the same time it looks kind of badass sick in a way too but i'm going to swap the rest of it out okay stay tuned here we go And uh, I have some bad news. Uh, I have some really bad news. You know, I'm going to go ahead and be honest because that's the type of person I am. But, you know, I know people kind of don't like what I've been doing to the car. And I guess you said, man, I'm going to keep thinking that he is unsuccessful and everything. Well, you see that right there. I appreciate that. I appreciate you guys wishing my downfall because these these mother suckers right here are so difficult to install 
they are a pain in the ass a little while ago in the same video that you're watching I said pain in the butt now I've amplified it to pain in the ass they are a pain in the ass to install if you don't have your tips in the way they're easy to install but since you have these tips and for the people out there that are running aftermarket tips like these are three and a half inch tips each if you have the four inch tips it's even going to be more difficult so love the lights I really do pain and ass to install I wasn't on a lift I didn't jack my car up to put these on I rolled my car back to where I had more room to work with and um, there it is so once again phase tech hero reflectors brand new product uh, product purchased them they're installed the degree of difficulty to install is a 10 okay a 10 once again I will say it is a 10 these are super difficult to install maybe it's different with those that have a regular Camaro SS that only has one single exhaust tip coming to the back it might not be so difficult for you guys or girls okay but for those of us for those of us that have dual exhaust tips coming out the back like I do here on my 17 SS 1 LE it's difficult as hell to install these so that's my bad news but as you can see they're installed so it's great news so I got those done and BAM I got the other passenger side tail light finished and it looks good it's actually still drying so hands down this was a DIY product uh, project you've seen the photos that uh, that I attached to this video kind of give you a process I didn't film the actual uninstallation and installation but I did take some photos of the process that I went by took out the tail lights I prepped them I taped them took them to the back of the house I sprayed them I let this one dry for about 30 minutes that one actually had the opportunity of drying all night before I put it back on but pretty much had the same color also what I did I'm not too happy about but it's pretty good I went ahead and tinted the third brake light so two tails third brake light all blacked out they do work let's see if I have my key fob there's my lights everything looks good it's all good beautiful as I like to say sometimes flawless victory so thank you guys for watching the video stay tuned for whatever else is coming up next I'm not spending big money on horsepower I'm spending small money on do-it-yourself projects for the car you don't have to go out there and spend big money to make your car look good you don't have to there's a lot of companies that are competing with one another and uh, they want your business there was another company I can't think of the name they were selling those for $19.99 and they were advertising it on Instagram I just didn't want the $19.99 reflectors I wanted the reflectors from hate from phase tech I ended up spending about ten dollars more I got these for $29.99 probably the same reflector but you know what I like doing my business with Ricardo Jason uh, and the other guys that are there so I went ahead and purchased these so that's what I did you don't have to do it I'm not telling you to do it but that's what I did anyway car looks good I'm gonna take a step back let you guys see this don't even think about the rest of the garage we're getting ready to move soon so I'm not even worried about the rest of the garage anyway I thank you guys for watching stay tuned definitely a lot more to come subscribe to the channel if you're a new subscriber or if you're new to my channel please subscribe 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 can't say that enough all right everybody have a good weekend make it a great week peace out